Whether it's an active shooter, severe weather, or even a train derailment, the city of Portland wants its residents to be able to receive alerts in case of serious emergencies and have that information readily available at their fingertips. We've got a team that works on the social media, does a great job, but this is another tool that we can use. It was a busy meeting in the office of the mayor of Portland. We alerted folks through social media we'd be doing this today between this time frame because the only way to really do it is to practice it. There it comes. There's where mine comes in too. Mayor Mike Callis joins the city's top first responders to enhance their code red alert system. This is a test of the code red system. No action is needed. He says it's all about keeping the people of Portland safe. We're trying to make a push to get people to sign up for code red. In our community, we're about as farther north as you can get, right before the state line. So we want to make sure people are aware in case there's an emergency because it takes a little time for other agencies to get to us if something was to happen. Callis says Portland has used code red for years and it would alert residents who sign up about severe weather. Let's try somebody else at launch code. You don't do that. This team wants the system to go a step further by adding alerts for other emergencies. As you guys can see, we've got a railroad that runs right through the middle of town. In case there was a, de a derailment, we have a major natural gas transmission line. Anything could go wrong. And so we're just trying to plan ahead about how to contact folks. It was last month when the city had a man shot and killed in the parking lot of a local gym and the gunman on the run. It was later learned the suspect died by a self-inflicted gunshot wound in Kentucky. Final test of code red system, August 2nd, 2024. Callis says this no is another action. example where people would Final get an alert. We discussed that if we have a situation like that in the future, not only would you want to alert them at the moment we find out about it, but once it's resolved. Good deal. In Portland, Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5.